do need uh, some international action as well as local because the local uh, uh, can make a big difference and in some places there are communities that are taking uh, very serious action that is reducing uh, greenhouse gases from that community rather dramatically but uh, if we get an international treaty that has some real fight to it uh, it may enhance the likelihood of other people taking action at multiple scales right now I'm very I'm nervous myself um, in that in some instances the uh, PES for example um, payment for ecological services uh, in some instances that um, has not been very well verified and um, it can be associated, unfortunately, uh, with uh, uh, deforestation and loss of biodiversity rather than the opposite. So the monetarization is something you're, you're worried about? Because it, in some instances, doesn't, isn't really to the people, the indigenous people, who uh, used to maintain a good deal of control over these areas. Mm -hmm. If it's a local fishery and just open access, uh, it is not in good condition. Mm -hmm. But uh, if indeed a group do have uh, responsibilities for managing that system, and their boundaries are clear, the leadership a variety of other factors are there, uh, they have been pretty successful. We've been arguing for a long time that there is no set of institutions that work perfectly always.